eight minute EMOM, all right, uh, five burpees on the minute. So every minute it's five burpees. So you guys have uh, 40 burpees in the workout. That's the start of each minute. And then we're doing, um, we're gonna alternate rounds, right arm, left arm, or vice versa, with lunsters. So the lunster is gonna be, and it's gonna be single arm, so it's gonna be uh, rack the weight up. You're gonna lunge on each leg, perform a single arm thruster, rinse and repeat till the end of that minute, then drop five burpees, go to the other arm, cycle through that. So eight minutes total, you'll do four rounds on each arm. Um, forward or reverse lunge, that's gonna be your guys' option. Um, and again, whatever whatever kind of items you have, Dan's gonna do it with a dumbbell, I'm doing it with a kettlebell. Um, and that's it. It's gonna be fun. Yeah. 
lower my heart rate, and my heart rate is pretty high, but I think it might have kept it lower, I'm not sure. And overall, I thought it was a really fun workout, different moves that we don't normally do, and emoms are a really challenging format, especially from a mental capacity, because you know you have to go, you get to go again at the next minute. Um, and also starting with burpees kind of spikes the heart rate and makes it a little more challenging. So that's all I have for you. I'll let Jade talk. All right, guys. Uh, let's see. Like you guys, well, we obviously have a good bit of gear. We're still limited on equipment, too. Um, we have a pair of 35 dumbbells and then a 35 and a 70 kettlebell. So I did that Saturday power hour workout with 35 pound dumbbells, and that was at least a couple hundred reps with the dumbbells. And I felt like since I was high rep, high turnover, um, hold on, I'm broken, try and offer something heavier. I know the 70 pound kettlebell is a bit of a bear for me. Anything that's not like a kettlebell swing. Um, front squatting, I find with kettlebells in general, especially difficult. And uh, that overhead, obviously hard. Thrusters are probably one of my worst slash least liked movements. So, I approach with a heavy weight, and then obviously with that in mind, different kind of intention and in how I got out the workout. I wasn't gonna go as hard as I could. Pace right from the get-go, five burpees at a moderate pace, and then take those complexes at a conservative pace. In the first round on each, I did three and three, and after that, I dropped to two, and that was plenty. Um, definitely breathing hard, but much more in an anaerobic spike, not this steady kind of, uh, steady state, high effort right at threshold is more up above threshold, back down, up above threshold, back down like that because that effort, just the lunge, lunge thruster with the 70 pound kettlebell for me, pretty big effort for one complex. And as you can see in the video, I just start putting it down after each complex, pick it back up. So definitely hard, but I can't remember the last time I used that 70 pound kettlebell for things like thrusters or getting overhead, squats, that kind of stuff. So uh, definitely a, a good good challenge for me for today and a good balance to that high volume, high rep stuff that I did um, uh, two days ago on Saturday. Uh, thanks for watching guys. Have a wonderful day.